Okay, so to be honest, I drank a lot while filming this, so don't mind this intro. Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Melissa, and today I have a What to Wear Wednesday for you guys. I literally, I literally have not filmed a What to Wear Wednesday since I was, I think like 21 years old. I'm pretty sure it's been like a year and a half, almost two years since I filmed a What to Wear Wednesday, which is crazy to think about. So obviously, from the last time I filmed a What to Wear Wednesday, my style has changed and evolved. So you're getting a whole new What to Wear Wednesday level up, Melissa 2.0 What to Wear Wednesday, whatever you want to call it. I would have to say my style has changed a ton in the last year and a half, two years, like crazy amounts, like a lot, a lot. I feel like I dress a little bit more mature, a little more neutral, and um, honestly, I've been really loving my style. Um, obviously, you guys know I have a ton of different aesthetics, like I'm not just one type of aesthetic, like I literally wear so many different styles. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. If you're not new here, welcome back to my channel. So if you're new here, What to Wear Wednesday is a segment where I post on Wednesdays. I used to be every Wednesday. I'm going to try to get back into posting them on every Wednesday or every other Wednesday where I answer your fashion dilemmas. So go ahead right now, pause the video and comment down below a fashion dilemma that you would like me to answer in next week's video. If you're new here, also follow me on all my social media, my Instagram, my Snapchat, my TikTok, my Depop, my Twitter, whatever I have. I'm gonna pop them all up right here for you guys to check out and follow. But without further ado, let's get in. Oh, subscribe. Also subscribe before you leave. But without further ado, let's get into this new and improved Mel 2.0 What to Wear Wednesday. Baby, we got issues. Yeah. Okay, question number one is how to style dad slash Bermuda shorts for the summertime. This is honestly one of my favorite favorite trends to wear. I don't know why, I just love it and I feel like it gives you good shape. But the way I styled it is, first of all, these uh, Bermuda shorts, you could easily thrift them but or like thrift some jeans and cut them, but these are actually from Brandy Melville. I don't own a lot of things from Brandy, but these are actually from there. I love the way I styled it with this like super, super cropped Prada top. It's actually just thrifted, it's not even real, but I just love the look of it. And then obviously I had to pair it with a Prada bag because you know Prada and Prada, we love that. And then some cute little sunglasses of course too and I just wanted to make the look a little bit more feminine because the dad shorts are a little bit more boyish. I added these mules which are honestly my favorite mules ever. They're thrifted and I literally wear them all the time. Okay the next question is how to style midi skirts. This look is oh it just makes me want to go to a barbecue like right now. It makes me want to get out of the house. Of course can't really do that but I think it's so flowy and fun and pretty and I need to be in Paris wearing this or just like doing something Thing, wearing this I just it just reminds me of like a hot summer day but I just have this bright red like this cherry red silky midi skirt these were really big last year and they're still gonna be really big if we're allowed out of the house this summer as well they're just really flowy and comfortable and I love the look of them honestly but I love wearing them with sneakers for sure so I just paired it with my Gucci sneakers and then I have this little bralette which is like also like kind of a silky material too which I feel like kind of I don't know I love the vibe of it I also love it t-shirt with this but I just kept it very like honestly more fancy than usual um but yeah I love this look I think it's so fun um I don't know uh I just had a little mini bag to go with it too it's just so flowy and fun and I love it and it's fresh oh and the top is from Zara the skirt is from H&M my shoes are Gucci and my um bag is just a thrifted Chanel bag but yeah, that is the how I style a mini skirt. I don't know, there's many ways to style this one. Okay, the next question is men's shorts without looking too masculine. Wearing men's shorts and just men's apparel is literally my favorite favorite thing especially for the summertime so I have these really comfortable like jogger shorts which are originally from H&M in the men's section they're very they're from the guy section so they're for guys but I love the fit of them again kind of like with that like Bermuda type of style I just love a masculine look I love you know mixing and matching um, feminine and masculine pieces so I paired it with this like asymmetrical off the shoulder or like one shoulder top which is actually from Brandy Melville it's weird I have 
a lot of things from Brady Melville in this um, in this video, which I don't shop there a lot. But yeah, I love this top. I think that it kind of gives it a feminine look to it because the shorts are so boyish. I also just love boy clothes on females, and I feel like uh, you could also just rock this with like a baggy t-shirt tucked in would look really cute too with the sneakers. Of course, I have my Balenciagas with this. And then I was thinking about you could definitely rock a mini bag with this too because um, it would be such a cute little look. But but I thought I would stick to like the masculine type of vibe that I was going with and I put this side bag with it too which I like the look of it too I feel like the cross body bag is very on trend and then again I added a little feminine touch with the headband the headband is something that I've been loving and especially with my blonde hair I love the black headband okay on to the next question so how to style silk statement tops guys I bought this top right before the quarantine and I'm so upset I have not been able to wear it yet but it's actually just from Aritzia it is in the most beautiful beautiful pistachio green color oh my gosh I love the cut of it it's it's a little bit cropped but it's not like overly too cropped and I just think it is so fancy um, but of course I wanted to dress it down a little bit because it is such a fancy piece so I paired it with these really fun houndstooth pants which honestly fit me so well I, they're thrifted however they are originally from forever 21 which is honestly non-existent in Canada anymore so I guess it's kind of like a vintage piece at this point but I just think that these are I just love pairing like uh, plaid pants which a lot of you guys asked uh, how to style plaid pants so here's kind of like a little way to style them and then I just have my platform shoes with it and then a little side bag in the green just to like tie the green with the green and then my Versace glasses just because I felt like silk top tops are a little bit more like fancy so I wanted to you know wear my Versace's okay how to style a fuzzy cheetah print bucket hat oh my goodness guys this look is incredible I want to leave the house wearing this right now like I'm obsessed with this look I just you know honestly this one I impressed myself a little bit with it um I just love a nude look right now I'm really into neutrals and the fuzzy bucket hat is something that has been really on trend lately and I know urban and all those types of companies have been selling them however mine's thrifted I think my mine is bomb af Definitely check Depop for them because I feel like a lot of people are probably selling them, but I love the neutral like look to this. I just honestly, I look like a little animal and I kind of love it. Is that weird to say? I don't know. I just, I played on with the nude and like the beige in the hat and the browns and stuck to that color palette and I really love the outcome of it. Um, the top is actually like a little bralette top that I found in the lingerie section at the thrift. Uh, the pants are from Zara, which I love the little crop leather pants, leather for the springtime, big trend. Again, just wearing my Gucci shoes. I wear these, I, I wear them too much, but you know, investment piece, gotta, gotta get some out of them um and then also um my bag is just like a little gucci bag side bag big super on trend still side bags you know i feel like the last time i did watch for wednesday side bags were not a thing but now they are okay now i have a bunch of looks that i want to share with you guys of what i'm gonna wear the first day that i'm out of quarantine this is a little bit more fun of a colorful look i didn't have that much color in this um yeah look i'm literally like so cute uh, yeah i'm obsessed with this look this is so this is so cute you, okay I love pastels it's a little bit spring summery vibes I love this purple with the yellow with the glasses with the little Louis bag that's monogram and colorful and then my platforms I just this is something that I'll be definitely rocking once we're allowed out of the house the pants are from Zara the top is a thrifted Louis bag and then my little platform he healed um, sneakers are from Windsor Smith yes Windsor Smith and then the glasses are just thrifted as well I just love this this is so fun I didn't have a lot of color in this video so I thought I'd share it with you guys you could also add like a cute little belt to this also I don't know I think it's like simple but it's also really cute different than what the other looks that I've been sharing with you guys but yeah one of my favorites for sure Okay, where is the next look? We're on to the next one, we're on to the next one. There it is. Okay, the next look, okay, I love blue. Blue on my with my blonde hair, I'm obsessed with, so I had to put a little blue look ski in here for you guys, a little denim look with my Balenciagas. This top is from Princess Polly. I love the front tie top, again, very on trend. Cardigans for the spring, summertime. You can thrift so many. I'm so excited to get back into the thrift store to 
thrifting so many cardigans but definitely a big trend i just paired it with my burberry bag and these like early 2000s vibe sunnies i'm really starting to intermix like early 2000s with like current um styles and i'm really been loving it so yeah that's this look the next look oh don't even get me started with this look oh my oh my gosh okay these shorts are everything again with the like how to style like bermuda or like dad shorts or boy shorts these are actually from simon's one of my favorite stores that i have been shopping in and shopping at a lot recently is simon's i found these and they were pretty cheap they were only like 30 dollars um which is actually quite the steal you could probably find something similar in the um thrift store they're very 80s but pairing it with like a very feminine top really made this look pop and then of course sticking with the like neutrals color palette and having my burberry bucket hat and my burberry bag is everything and then again some sneakers because your girl lives in sneakers and i love being comfortable so i had to pair this with some sneakers i love this look i'm about to go take a picture in it okay oh this look too i oh this i just want to go out and this is what i'd be wearing at the bar right now these shoes are everything if i'm not in sneakers these are what i'm going to be wearing all spring and summer long i paired this zebra printed long sleeve top which honestly is something that i feel like i would have worn in like high school at this point and now it's kind of making its rounds back again but i'm just styling it a little bit differently than i used to um and it's just from aritzia i love the fit of it and then this mini skirt is everything this is such a staple in my wardrobe it's actually thrifted it was like five dollars and i wear it all the time it's actually a skirt, so you know no slip ups these shoes are from ray which are from revolve they gifted them to me and i am obsessed with them they're called the yacht heel i believe and then i wanted to add a little pop of color with this bag of course and you can't really see my hair but i have like a really cool clip in it as well which i'm obsessed with wearing these clips for the um for right now i'm obsessed with wearing them they're like the little butterfly clips that make your hair i don't i can't even describe them but anyways this is something that you would definitely catch me at the club like right now like i'm ready to go let's go can we go let's leave the house but yeah i'm a little i was a little bit drunk filming this so you know we're kind of at the club we're at the club in the house at my house okay where's the next look oh that's all of them okay guys that sums up this video i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please give it a big old thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below before you leave i love you guys and i will catch you guys in the next video peace i don't say peace <laughs> bye <laughs>